the coach from Pastige 470-2 so it'll take you through a quick operation guide of the caravan above the door as you come in you've got your main master switch so when I hit that the power will come on inside the caravan then I'll hit the light button next as you can see now we've got lights on inside the caravan awning light voltmeter for your battery on board water pump when it's connected it will run on that switch just there and as I said the master switch on the top right hand side very simple to use as we come around the caravan down below the seat we've actually got the gas control for the water heater on board the caravan to operate the water heater simply turn the top dial around to the gas symbol it will then ignite on gas if it doesn't ignite on gas you'll get a little red light up here just inside here which it will do in a moment there we go and then if it's ignited you can control the temperature of the water heater with this dial on the outside to turn it back off simply twist the dial and it will turn back off to use the heating you've got a control on this wall just here turn it around to 500 watts which is the power supply we can use here on site 500 watts of power and then you'll be able to control the temperature of the heater on this dial at the front here underneath the seat on this side you will actually have your water tank itself which will be just down the back here the little yellow switch at the front here is actually for your drain down switch on board the caravan so at the moment the tank's completely empty with the tap in this position when I flick it down you can fill the onboard water tank with the water pump turned on grey box here is your motor mover and the little red switch just there is your motor mover power switch inside the cupboard On the front of the heater itself, you've got your dial on top to control the heater on gas. If you turn it around between 10 and 9 and hold the dial down, you'll be able to hit the igniter and heat the heater up on gas. On the right hand side of the heater, you've actually got your fan controls to the blown air heating. You've got continuous blown air and automatic, then on the dot in the centre, the heat will come out the front of the heater itself. The cooker, self-explanatory, I'm not going to go into too much detail about that, I'm sure everybody's more than capable of using the cooker. With the fridge, you've got a power button on the front of the fridge, you can turn the power on. Once it's on, you can select what power supply you want to use by tapping this button here. So you've got mains power supply, 12 volt battery supply from the car, and gas. So control the temperature of the fridge, you've got the button on the right hand side. Going into the bathroom itself, I've got an electric flush on the toilet, so you just hit the button and the electric flush will work. Then underneath you've got your grey flap to open the waste trap in the centre of the in the centre of the toilet. Again with the shower self-explanatory with the taps. I'm not going to offend you by running through how a tap works. That's the basic operation of the Coachman Pastige 472. If you have any questions, please do give us a call and we'll do what we can to help you over the phone. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.